Hey everybody, welcome back to another video this week. Um, I'm going to do a quick review on the Ace Classic 33s. Um, that's like the 8 inch version. Uh, I have it on a 8 inch girl board. If you couldn't tell from some of the slow-mo shots there, I actually set up Bones bushings in that. And with the Bones bushings, what that does is it just gives you like a quicker response. I feel like the trucks like snap back to where they're supposed to be a little bit quicker. And um, if you can't tell from the footage too, I actually put like one of the metal washers the Bones come with on the bottom and I put two on the top. And that's just so that my, uh, my top bolt doesn't have a couple threads showing. Um, but it's very important to put one on the bottom when you do this because if you hold up a Bones uh, coned bottom bushing to a, an Ace bottom bushing, you'll see that the Ace is a little bit bigger. So if you just put the Bones in without that bottom washer, it'll actually kind of mess up the geometry of the truck. And also, um, you know, if you're not using the bottom washer that came with them anyway, you're definitely going to want to have something there. So I love the way this is set up. So I actually got these um, about a month before the AF1s came out. And I'm not super mad about it because I've heard from a few people that the metal on the AF1s is very similar to like Thunder Independent. This is a little bit of a softer metal uh, and it grinds really good on curbs and metal and everything like that. The only downside is it does wear down a little bit faster from what I've heard. And I've had a pair in the past that I crooked through pretty quickly. But at my, my age now, I'm not really uh, grinding a crazy amount. I'm not skating every single day, so they last me just fine. I am interested in trying like those lure pivs because of the, uh, the the metal they use. It's like an aluminum type metal. Don't quote me on that. I just off the top of my head. Um, but yeah, so I uh, I really like these trucks a lot. Uh, I think the turn on them is super great. I actually think. Uh, these kind of messed me up on the mids because if you remember when I previously did the original mids video, um, I didn't like hate them. Uh, it just messed up like pop timing and stuff for me. I'm sure if you just skated them for months, you would get used to that. And uh, just like, you know, anything, if you skate it long enough, you'll get used to it. But with these, I got so used to this super sharp surfy turn. that um, when I tried skating the mids again, it was almost like impossible. I uh, I was like tic-tacking up to stuff, even with them so loose, I, you know. Once you ride an Ace Classic, I feel like it's super hard to try to ride anything else. You're just so used to that swervy, turny, carvy type feel. And um, it that also takes getting used to because obviously with that comes flip trick problems where like you'll bend down to pop a 360 flip and you start turning because the trucks are like almost like loose but even if you have them kind of tight like they'll still do it just they're that turny but I, I personally I love that that feeling when you're skating and you can just carve and turn and um you know and, and it's something that if you get used to it it really helps out certain tricks too you can land and kind of instead of tic tacking out you kind of could swerve out of things so I, I personally love them. I heard that the AF1s are a little different. They have like a slightly different geometry where they turn a little, not as loose as these. So I'm already kind of like hesitant on buying them because I don't want, I, I like these. And the AF1s have that different metal where it's almost similar to like a Independent or a Thunder or a Venture. But yeah, I, I don't know. So I'd like to try them, but I feel like it would just be like, skating an independent whereas this is like this feels like an, app, an actual different truck but that being said i definitely recommend them i think it's a super good truck if you have the af ones uh let me know if you skated both the classics and the af ones and how they compare in the comments below i'm really interested to uh hear other people's takes on it but yeah i think uh i think these are going to be just the standard that i ride for a while and like I said, maybe I'll splurge on the Lurpivs in the spring or something. But for now, this is what I'm going to be riding. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, like I said, uh, they're holding up great for me. Uh, I haven't had any problems with them, with the Bones bushings. Um, no blowouts. 
uh, yeah, look, they, they work perfect. So that being said, thanks for stopping in, checking out this week's video. Sorry, it's kind of a, um, you know, just a talking video, no, not much skating. Uh, but yeah, I just kind of wanted to get the review of the uh, classic Ace trucks out of the way. So that being said, like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys either tomorrow or next week.